Today we're opening up Night Wonder, guys. This set came out in Japan today, June 7th, and we are giving it away. All you gotta do is subscribe to the channel and comment your favorite song in the comment section. We will choose a comment at random and give the box away one week from today. As a bonus, I'm throwing this in. We're gonna open this as well. I have no idea what it is, but my supplier gave it to me and it looks cool. So Night Wonder is the Japanese version of uh, what the English set Shrouded Fable will become. And it's uh, probably gonna be pretty cool. So let's, let's see what we got. Okay, we got the camera settings fixed. We got Galvantula as our uncommon there. On to pack number two. I am pretty happy to be opening this set on release date, guys. I don't always get sets on release date, so I'm feeling pretty cool right now. Gonna be one of the first on YouTube. Let me know what your favorite card is that we see. I really like the Absol. I Ooh, there we go. We got the Art Rare Dusk Noir, guys. This is um, probably one of my favorite sets. I like the Dusk Clops, Dusk Skull, and Dusk Noir little lineup. I'm pretty sure you're guaranteed uh, maybe like three or so Art Rares. We'll have to look at the... Look at the actual pull rates on uh, pokebeach.com. I think they leaked, so we'll have to check that out. I like the Koo fonts. I was a big fan of the Rocks. Rowlet, of course. The Zubat I really liked. I think I gave that an A or an S tier on my on my list. Sylveon I definitely gave an S tier to. Um, not really because the card is like crazy magnificent, but because Sylveon's pissed off. And you just don't see Sylveon like mad. It's, she's always cute and cuddly, and she's so powerful. Like... Give her a chance to shine, Pokemon. They did. She looks like a badass there. So, S tier. Uh, Penny, obviously pretty cool. There's a uh, couple trainer cards of Penny that I think will be quite popular. There's a Yvettel. God, these cards are really cool, honestly. It's nice seeing them in person after uh, going through the pokebeach.com leaks because, I don't know, I feel like I already know the set pretty well just from tier listing it. I'm going to start doing that with every set because I think it kind of keeps me connected to the hobby. Um, obviously, I used to do ripping chips all the time, and uh, now I don't, so it keeps me connected. I really like the Dusclops here, guys. I was a big fan of the forest around him. It looks super creepy. Could have been a little more colorful, but I, I like it. Hey, it's the Ursa Luna Hollow Rare. Very nice. Ursa Luna is one of those Pokemon from the, uh, the... I'm an old head, you know, I'm 31, guys. But one of those Pokemon, I thought, that's probably not very necessary. Uh, and so I haven't even played the DLC. I just kind of thought it was, like, unnecessary. But one of those few Pokemon where the card artists make me love the Pokemon. It's probably not going to happen with Okie Dogi or Monkey Dory, to be honest. I don't think much can save them as far as uh, gaining my affection. The Weavile. Zerua, I really like. Hey, we got one of the uh, freaking EX cards. We got Kingdra EX. Very, very nice. Look at that sparkle, though. Ooh, God, the camera is nice. Camera is nice today. All right, let's get him that top loader. Yeah. Uh, if you guys are wondering what camera I'm using for the cards, it's called the uh, Insta360. I'm not sponsored. I just, I like to share it with people because it's so freaking nice. All right, I don't know how many packs we're in yet, but another Sylveon. I don't know how many packs we've done already, but we're, we're going to continue onward. Ooh, okay, so there's our SR. We got the uh, Pecherunts. Pe Pecherunts. Pecherunts SR. That's, uh, that's a pretty good one, actually. Secret Rare Pecherunt EX. It's honestly looks like a Wild Berry Pop-Tart. I've said that with a lot of cards in this set because they're all like purple and blue. All right, well, somebody is going home with a Petra EX along with the rest of these cards, guys. Again, we're giving this whole box away, so all you got to do to qualify is subscribe to the channel and uh, comment your favorite song in the comment section. I'll use a random comment picker. We'll go live in a week, and we'll let the we'll let the AI choose choose who wins. Was that Furfru? Oh, the Hound Doom. I love the Hound Doom. Straight out of freaking Hellfire, guys. They did a really good job with uh, Houndoom's uh, normal common card and then the art rare. They really crushed it. We got Tapu uh, Bulu. I don't like any of the Tapus. Tapu Coco's cool. And anyway, Tapu, uh, what, what's the other one? It's like the the feminine looking one. She's cool. But I don't know. I don't know. They're kind of weird. I wasn't a Sun and Moon guy, clearly. Alright, we got... Um, 
the Sidua. Jeez, sheesh. Evie's cute. I really, really liked the uh, the horsey. I think I gave horsey an S tier rating too. It just makes you so happy. It's a very happy card. I did not like any of the Axie line. None of them. So I don't know. It's so it, they did they did Axie and Hexorus dirty man. They just they're not exciting. I forgot your name. Some some weird X name. This card, um, Drowsy. I, it kind of reminded me of a Studio Ghibli movie. It looks very like Spirited Away vibes. I think it's the onion spirit in the elevator, and it, I don't know, he has that look. So for that, Joltik. And uh, Weavile, I think Sneasel looks really good in this set. I forgot why I liked Sneasel, but I'm, I'm pretty sure I was a big fan, so we'll, maybe, we'll get, maybe we'll get that. Hypno I really liked, so that's very like, <laughs> just MDMA vibes. They did a good job, someone, someone was doing some good stuff before they made that. Snuffle's just freaking cute. Crawling the log, adventure mode. Kingdra, um, to go against the adorableness of Horsey, the Kingdra card kind of kind of delivers. Looks like he's in a battle. Oh, Joltik and Kirim. Pretty cool uncommon card. I feel like they all kind of look like that, though. I don't know. I want to see some more creativity with Kirim cards. Another Weavile. My goodness. We're going to see a lot of doubles in the set, guys. It's not a big set at all. Ooh. Oh, we got the horsey, the horsey art rare. Let's go. The uh, the pokey gods definitely watched my tier list video on how much I love horsey. N nobody likes horsey. Horsey's such a he, he's he's such a, a wallflower Pokemon. Like he just kind of people forget about him. Not me though. Not this set. Whoever the artist is, uh, Shin Shinya Komatsu. They didn't forget about horsey. They crushed. All right, we got uh, what do we got now? We got two art, or we got an art rare. Two art rares, uh, an EX card, and then the SR EX card. So there's a Petron EX, Horsey, a Kingdra, and then Dusk Noir. So we're doing pretty good, guys. I like doing these giveaways. They're fun. I get the experience of opening up the cards, and you get the cards. It, it's a nice even trade. This is most like over-engineered uncommon card probably in Pokemon. Look at the, I think those are called Mandela's. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not that artsy. Super over-engineered uncommon card. And I, I mean that in the best way. I like Beware. He's cool. Zubat. I can't get over that card. Uh, Krogunk and uh, Toxicroak. Meh. Uh, what's his name? Freaking, uh, oh my god. Uh, Genesect. Genesect look cool. Good colors on Genesect. All right, let's get these. Oh my goodness. I haven't done a rip and ship in some time, y'all. Let's get these common and uncommon and rares kind of put you guys aside here. And you know what? The people on uh, YouTube, they always have the cool cards displayed. Yeah, there we go. Now we're aesthetic. All right, moving on. We're probably about halfway through. Another Hypno. Ooh, I liked the Meowth card a lot, guys. Common Meowth. Again, the commons and uncommons uh, lately in these like past several sets have really hit. That's a cool looking card. I don't like the Rowlet line very much, but Rowlet's adorable and Dartrix is boring. But in this particular instance with his little friends, I'm a big fan. These guys are like chatting with each other. It's a cute ass card. Well done. Duskull. And I think this is Monkey Dory, double R. So we got a Monkey Dory EX. I want to say you get like two, like three EX cards per box. So there's your Monkey Dory EX. There's not a lot of EX cards um, to really choose from in the lineup. So most of you guys are probably going to get, well, most of you guys are probably going to get most of these cards. You don't really need to buy a ton of boxes uh, to collect like 90% of the set. There's a lot of SRs and whatnot. That's how Pokemon makes their money, you know. But other than that, there's not a ton of variety, and I, that's all right. You know, it's just a an expansion set. Ooh, I love this one, guys. The uh, Zygarde. No, oh my God, what's uh, Z Zoroark? Jesus, the Zoroark walking away from the urban landscape back there. He looks like he just did some like. He, he looks like he murdered somebody, actually. He looks like he did some, like, really bad crime. So, yeah, huge fan. I like a lot of the, the cards with, like, an urban landscape, because Pokemon, I mean, I mean, rightfully so, they're basically animals. They're usually in nature, or they're just kind of in, like, an arbitrary 
artscape kind of thing, like the Volcarona. It's not Volcarona, it's like Iron Moth or something, my bad. I don't know, the Paradox Pokemon. So, yeah, it's, you know, outdoors. I, I actually do like the Houndor card quite a lot. It looks like he's in, like, Red Rocks, Colorado. But I like it when they're inside. Oh, there's the Petra EX. So this is the non-alt-art um, version, of course. The non-SR version, but another EX card for our EX pile. I don't get Petra personally, but the card is pretty. I mean, objectively, it's a pretty card. I don't really get the Pokemon. Maybe I got to play the DLC to fully respect him. But let's put him side by side with his counterpart there. Not bad. So I haven't done um, box breaks in a while. But I remember back when I did them regularly. You could get uh, double bangers is what we called them. So two SRs in the same box. Or like, ooh, I love the, I love the gold bat. The lava, the good contrast. Ah, the colors. But uh, yeah, you could get more than one SR in a box if you were super lucky. So we pulled that SR really early, so maybe maybe it'll be a lucky box. We'll see. The Persian card's cool. Um, obviously, nothing compared to the Persian card that leaked from the... Uh, or no, it's an art rare. It's an art rare. There's an art rare Persian. Nice. There's Cresselia. I love Cresselia in this set. Really peaceful. Dreamy vibes. I like it. Yeah, there's a Persian uh, art rare of some sort. Or altar. There's so many different words nowadays. But yeah, he is like looking out the window, looking all menacing, and it's definitely a good uh, foreshadowing for the Team Rockets, Team Rocket set coming out in 2025. I think they did a good job with that. Fracture, eh, eh, eh. There's the Sneasel. Yeah, he's, yeah, I like him. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, I said he looked like a looks. Is the art artwork that looks like a Powerpuff Girl anime show? I don't know. How's the Powerpuff Girl vibe to it? Oh, Lord. Lord Almighty. All right. Let's see what we got. Crobats. Boring. Like it. In case, cool. Good color scheme on that. Kind of uh, toned down. You know, it's very, like, toned, but I, I do like it. Simple. A lot of, a lot of Galvanchula. I had a tarantula growing up in college. He was pretty cool. His name was Winston. Winston died recently. Uh, my cousin adopted him, but he lived eight years, so Winston had a good life. Ooh, okay, here's the ace spec card. We got the laser gun, guys. These are trippy. I really like the ace spec, uh, the, the pink. The, the colors of the ace spec cards are really cool. Obviously, that pattern is super trippy. So you're guaranteed one ace spec card in every box of Night Wonder. I don't know what they do. I'm, I don't play the, the TCG game, so I, I actually have no idea. But I remember people being pretty excited about this. Um, it's like kind of a reintroduction of a concept and some set from bygone eras. As far as I know, you can only use one Ace Spec item card like per game. I don't know. If you're buying the Japanese version, you're, chances are you're collecting and you're not playing the game with these, but... Shrouded Fable, that's going to be the set for you guys. This is uh, going to, most of these cards are going to appear in Shrouded Fable, I should say. Let's see Vettel again. A lot of doubles here. We've almost seen the whole freaking common, uncommon, rare set. Man, I really want to pull that Persian, though. That Persian was really cool. Maybe we'll pull him here. Malamar, that's a new one for us. Stretcher, meh. Meh. All right. We're going for the Persian, ladies and gentlemen. I don't even know if we're going to get another art rare. I think we get one more art rare. I want to say one more. Shout out to the people that find all that data. Danny Phantom, he's always got some pull rate data that I, I don't know where he gets it from, if he opens them all or what, but that dude grinds, man. I live a simpler life on YouTube myself, but shout out, shout out to him. Ooh, Dusk Noir uh, Hollow Rare. Nice. Okay, that'll go with our... Art rare we got. I like the pairings. We get we're getting some good pairings in today. Very nice. Let's uh put them side by side. Look at those friends. That's pretty haunting, honestly. It looks like he's coming right out the card to grab you by the neck. Very cool. And then this one he just kind of looks like a friendly neighborhood guy named George. Yeah, different vibes. Different vibes for the Dust Noir. Uh just a handful of packs left, guys, so 
We're going for that Persian. That's the chase card. Or or a, a double banger. Get a, another SR or something. We'll see. Rowlet's pretty cute. Very symmetrical. I like it. Another Persian. Oh, there's a Haxorus Hollow Rare. I kind of dissed the Haxorus line already today, so I'm not going to be too excited about that. But hey, maybe the winner of this giveaway will love Haxorus. Who knows? I hope you do. Comment your favorite song and subscribe to the channel. Alright, I apologize by the way if my eyes look super like trippy. It is 311. Good band by the way. Great song. Great songs. It's 311 right now. AM of course. And uh, yeah, I'm dying. Ladies and gentlemen. So, I'm not doing anything extra. Ooh, damn. I'm not, I was going to say I'm not doing nothing extracurricular. But uh, you would think I was when you look at the, uh, this is Iron Moth, I think, or it's the, it's, it's the Volcarone, I don't know, what, what are these, what is it, okay, the other one is Iron Moth, this one's Sil Slitherwing, Slitherwing, I'm gonna get so much crap for that from the Paradox people, that's a trippy card, man, him and uh, Hypno have been chilling, where's the Hyp uh, Hypno's in this pile? I don't know. You guys have seen the card. Him and Hypno be tripping together. I like it. Alright, what else we got? A couple more packs. But yeah, I've been up all night. Uh, Vibrant, the Paldean Vibrant tins came out. They weren't very popular, but we did sell quite a few regardless. Ooh. That's pretty. Cresselia Art Rare. I didn't see this one. I did my tier list before the whole set list leaked because I knew I'd be too busy to do it later. And I don't think, I don't remember seeing this one. And if I did, it was very underwhelming on Pokey Beach's website. This is gorgeous in real life. Wow. Okay, nice. Yeah, I, okay, nice. Someone's going to win this Cresselia. Yeah, if, I don't remember seeing this on my tier list. Um... Like I said, it, it might have just looked underwhelming on the computer screen. It might look underwhelming to you guys watching my my video. But I assure you, it's very, very pretty. That's stunning. I really like the, uh, just the normal, the normal card we pulled earlier too. I don't know where that's at. Oh, here he is. I guess it's not normal, it's a hollow. God, that's a pretty card. Mmm. Tasty. Alright, good stuff. Oh, I dropped a common. I dropped the horsey. My bad. My bad. I could not be a whatnot streamer. All all the all the cards I move and pull off to the side. I, I just couldn't do it. Alright, we got two more packs, right? Yeah. Yeah, two more packs. And then after that, we're gonna open up whatever the hell that is. I met a new supplier uh, recently. And I kind of tested them out. I was like, yeah, I'll buy a case of 151. Because, you know, a new supplier, you got to start small. And he gave me a couple of those weird, goofy packs um, as kind of a thank you for trying me out gift. So I appreciate that. We'll see what's up. That Pheasantipity? I like the, I like their names. They're cute. The Pheasantipity is definitely my favorite of the, uh, the three. I forgot what they go by, but definitely my favorite of the three. She's super pretty. I mean, it's a pretty card. Beautiful art. I don't. I don't remember what the great three or. I don't remember, but yeah, Monkey Dory, um, whatever the other one is, and and Pheasantipity. Yeah, Pheasantipity is cool. Oki Oki Dogi, I think. Monkey Dory Oki. Their names are super clever. I'll I'll give I'll give an S tier for the naming mechanics behind them. All right. Well, cool. So that's our uh, third EX card, I think. Not including the secret rare. So yeah, I think the EX cards, I mean, you're all going to pretty much get the same thing I did today. So there's no need to go balls to the wall on this set, guys. By no means. I'm, save your money is what I'm saying. Save your money for Shouted Fable. That's going to be... I think that's going to be the one. Well, no, no, no. Save your money for the Team Rocket set, actually. Stop buying from me. We got Team Rocket coming, baby. Alright, this is the last pack. Last pack magic, guys. LPM, babes. Meowth. Fracture. Star Tricks. Wow, really? That? Really? That? Okay. What a... I was going to say, what an anticlimactic way to end it, but we have this, so this is going to help. So, yeah, again, I really don't know what this is. Here's a picture of it, and they they look like candy? Maybe it's candy. I don't know. Oh. Oh, there's a cart. What? There's a cart in here? 
Interesting. Huh. I still don't know what these are. It feels like something, uh, like one of those gummy, like, hands, like, the 90s kids know that you, like, fling on the drywall and then mess up the paint. I think it's food. <laughs> it's, like, sticky. Smells really good. It's, like, the intrusive thoughts. I, does, that doesn't look like food to me. Do I eat it? It's gotta be food. I hope it's food. <laughs> Did I eat, like, just rubber? I might have just straight up consumed rubber. There's it's candy, candy. thank goodness. Up, now that I know it's edible, it tastes quite good. Um, obviously I can't send that now, but I will send the Tinka Tink with the uh, box, so. There you go. It's pretty good, actually. Alright. I feel, I feel a lot better about knowing that that's real now. So, let's go over our polls here, ladies and gentlemen. I think we did pretty well. That was our, our first box of uh, Night Wanderer. And yeah, we got some cool stuff. Okay, so we'll go over just the normal hollow rares. We got uh, Ursa Luna. Not Zygarde. Zorark. Got Haxorus. Dust Noir. Uh, Tapu Bulu. Oops. And the Tinka Tink. And then the Cresselia. Is that it? Yep. Here we've got the A Spec Laser Gun. Super pretty. Uh, the Petrarunt EX, uh, the Secret Rare variant, and then the Normal EX. We got the Dustin War Art Rare, which I adore. Fezendipity EX, the Cresselia Art Rare, which I do adore more, I must say. More adore from Cresselia. Mm -hmm. We got uh, Kingdra EX. And then uh, Monkey Dory EX. And then the Horsey Art Rare, which... I said it in my tier list, um, hot take, but the normal common horsey actually looks cooler to me. So again, if you want a chance to win these cards, all you gotta do is subscribe to the channel and comment your favorite song below. I will use a random comment picker next week to find a comment. We'll do it live so everything's legitimate. If you wanna support the store, go to pokeyne.com. We do have all the newest products. We actually just stocked a 15 pack variety bundle. It's got 15 packs all in one. It's very giftable. It's 15 packs for 50 bucks. We also have a new section on the site for sealed cases. You scroll over Pokemon and click sealed cases. Um, we've got them all right here. You can organize them by Japanese only or English. So yeah, go to pokeyany.com and buy my stuff. And always remember to have a wonderful day. Thank you very much.